Week 9 of high school football kicking off tonight with a bang. A couple of key 7A Region 1 matchups on this rare Thursday night. Teams battling it out in hopes of earning a spot in the last spot of the playoffs. It's senior night for the Murphy Panthers as they host the Fairhope Pirates, a team that has made a phenomenal turnaround from last season's second to last finish in the region to now sitting at the top. But it's the Panthers who come out of the gates clong with a little trickeration action. QB Maurice Robinson flicks it up to Lamar Harris, who launches that cannon 80 yards to wide open Michael Jefferson for the touchdown. Murphy goes up 7-0 early. It's not long before the Pirates invade the Panthers' waters as Gibbs Cheryl splashes in from the one-yard line for the touchdown tied up at seven. Second quarter action. Fairhope is attacking again. It's third and 15 as Devin Mitchell drops back throws the pass behind Aiden Thompson, who somehow makes the incredible catch for the first down a few plays later. And it's Mitchell who practically walks it in untouched for the seven yard touchdown to give the Pirates the 13 to seven lead. But Fairhope wants more. This time, Mitchell connects with his main go-to man, CJ Edwards, who looks like he's gonna get tackled, but he says, nope, I want this touchdown. Edwards goes on to have four touchdowns on the night to help lead the Panthers to a 46 to 26 win over Murphy. Fairhope remains undefeated in region play while Murphy drops to three and four. And over in Theodore, another big 7A region one matchup tonight is the Bobcats welcome in the Alma Bryant Hurricanes. Theodore alum and now Florida Gator stud LaMichael Piran in the house tonight to sport his Bobcats and apparently he was their good luck charm. Bobcats up 7-0 trying to strike again. QB Trevor Andrews hits Hunter Tillman. Big game deep in Bryant territory. They settle for the field goal. That goes right to the upright. It gives Theodore a 10-0 lead. Second quarter action now. Bobcats one Wanting more, Carlton Norris takes the big skin up the middle, breaks the tackle, and is off to the races for the 24-yard touchdown. That puts Theodore up 17-0, and it's Theodore who comes out on top, taking down Alma Bryant 31-7. The Bobcats advance to 3-3 three three in region play, putting them one win closer to that last spot in the postseason. Don't worry, guys. The action is just getting started. Tomorrow night, we have a whole slate of big matchups, including our game of the week featuring Thomasville and UMS Wright, two teams that are fighting for that home field advantage in the first round of the postseason. Live look-in start in at 9, and it's highlights and reaction at 10 on the one and only first.